Welcome to Sydney, Australia. This is where I spend the vast majority of my time and I've spent 99.99999% of my time uh, not only gaming but living. Uh, I've done three trips this year uh, to Asia to, to run immersions and uh, before that it was probably four years before I went overseas before. Now I'm a guy in my 40s, I've had a few hip replacements yet I'm having a lot of success with women in a first world country. I don't live in a third world country. I have, a, have that success in a first world country here alone. Now the thing here is, I'd like to just point out one thing that I think is a massive misconception. Uh, you don't need a wing for day game. And this is the cold hard truth. Don't get angry at me, get angry at yourself. If you need a wing, to go out and do some day game and approach some girls don't get angry at me just look inside yourself men who do that are pussies there's no two ways about this if you need a wing to stand 20 30 meters away from you while you have a one-on-one -on -one conversation with a girl because you're too afraid to go do it by yourself and a lot of guys will say oh i need some friends i want to make some wings just be honest with yourself, you're afraid to approach because you're a pussy. And on top of that, if you've done some coaching before and you know you apparently know what you're doing and you still need wings, you're, you're stuck in beginner, amateur or even uh, intermediate purgatory at best. Uh, because no one who is intermediate needs a wing and definitely no one who is advanced needs a wing. Unless you have an old friend of yours and you want to come out and go out and go have a little bit of a joke and do a few approaches for fun or you're traveling together etc there's other reasons for it but if you are joining up to groups seeking out men that you don't really know that well you're not really friends with they're not part of your social circle just so that you can day game with them as wings you have to be realistic you're a pussy and I don't mean to insult you I just need to give you that reality check because no one out there that uh, actually is not afraid to approach girls and he's having success in a first world country like Sydney you can see this is the Opera House needs a wing I, I personally don't reach out to guys to wing me uh, but I'll have friends or I'll have acquaintances that I know will go for coffee and a walk and do a few approaches this is just how proper day gamers do it it becomes a lifestyle but if you need a wing you need to huddle in one area and become a spam bot with some wings standing by you then no offense but you're a pussy and probably a loser okay and if you've been doing it for a while and you like to tell people that you know what you're talking about it's time to do some self-reflection uh, because I'm a man in in my 40s and I don't really have any troubles at all uh, and if you're in your 20s where you're gonna hook almost every single set and you still need a wing and you're fit and healthy and you can run and you've got all these other good things going for you you're a pussy sorry to say that you need to do some team sports you need to hit the gym it's time to man up time to level up as a man uh, and stop playing those pretend games that a lot of guys do out there this gets me to the next level of this is that uh, if you've done some coaching and you still are out there seeking out wings and you're not doing it because it's a social thing you're doing it purely because you need a wing to approach and you can't do it without a wing and uh, you find yourself that you have more success when you have wings around there which is a, a red flag in itself then it's time to do some proper coaching with a coach that actually knows what he's talking about and they're rare out there very few of them live in first world countries that are difficult to game like this one here uh, and reach out to me I live in Sydney Australia cold approach coaching from someone who actually knows what they're doing and lives in a first world country it's funny how recently I have suffered from some criticism from guys living in third world countries <laughs> they're criticizing my game when I'm living here and they're living in Bangkok <laughs> or South America or something and um, you need to have a look at the reality of how the world works have a look at yourself have a deep look at yourself and uh, top link in the description Go to my website, check out the blog post that I've got there. I've got some on indirect game. Indirect game is the, the most advanced method out there. You need it for a first world country. If you're not using it, then you're not going to have the success an indirect guy has. 
I also recommend that you check out the 30 day challenge for newbies it's a digital course that I have created for new guys like yourself that will need wings uh, check it out it's dirt cheap it's a couple bucks like it's dirt cheap read some, read all the the freebie material and if you want to learn a little bit about myself uh, the, the Disabled Casanova is my book. It's kind of like my autobiography. Uh, and uh, check out, you know, someone who's actually lived a life can impart a lot of knowledge and wisdom, wisdom onto you. And that's why I wrote that book. So I have an understanding of what I've been through in my life. And therefore, uh, it's, it's, I'm an example of someone who can help you. Check out the website. Check out the 30-day challenge. And check out my book. See you guys in the next video.